Dr. Maz, you are on mute. Look at that. Can you guys hear me now? Yeah, we, we, we can hear you, Dr. Maz. It's good. Uh, how are you gentlemen doing this evening? Uh, doing good. We straight. Okay. Good. Um, I want to get straight into it today. Uh, I've been talking a lot about these products and things. And I kind of strayed away from those people that don't know about the product. So I want to kind of pay homage to the Karens are, that are still out there. Oh, free. oh you're here to, to do your, <laughs> oh, you're here to do your real time slot now, huh? You, you're not here trying to sell no, no shit, huh? No, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. I have uh, no idea what you're talking about. Uh, Dan, but I think I had a time flat last week too, Dr. Mask. Oh God, we're gonna do this now. Please continue, Dr. Mask. Let us play. Thank you. Thank you, uh Tom. Thank you. I don't know what Dan is referring to, but anyways, I'm gonna keep it moving to uh my that time flat you sold, but okay. Huh? That that time flat you sold, but okay. It, it's cool, it's cool. Just I go. So something only thing I've only thing I'm selling is is NYB. By the way, you can get that on my website at drmass.com. Let's, let's, um, let's go to the clip. Yes, play the clip for me, please. Thank you. Fucking school with kids. <laughs> uh, viewer discussion. Sure. Rosa County, guess what? You're fucking being investigated. And I'm suing you too for what you fucking did. Oh, wow. For what? You fucking did to show me the fucking order of protection that literally says denied. Says denied! Mm. And where it says Ren requests a hearing, you fucking retard! Jeez. So, what's, what's going, going on here is retard. that this woman was banned from her children's school. Um, so they banned her from, from entering the premises. They said, hey, you can pick up your daughter, pick up your son, but you cannot come in the building because she was what happened was she was coming in without signing in and, and became an issue. So then they told her, look, you can't you can't come in without signing in. They said she continued to do it. Then they banned her. And then after the ban, she continued to trespass on the school. So now they um, got a straining order on on this this lady here. So. One of the things I want to point out is that when a when a Karen, I mean, you look, you can look at this face here. The look at the rage. rage that she's in. It just goes to show you how irate these Karens can get. So what what happened was that she doesn't realize how in the wrong she was because she took it upon herself to patrol the school and be all through the school. And they said, "Look, you can't be in a common area. You have you have to be only here. Pick up your child and go only here." And she roaming all over the school and stuff trying to investigate and now once they she's seeing this order being released now she's mad at the school board and she wants to retaliate on them but what i want to say to this lady is that if a school bans you if you have a child attending a school and they ban you from from entering that school you are the problem so you want to look inside yourself and see what it is you're doing wrong like, why would they even want to ban me? So then her daughter had a play and her, her uh, she wanted her to go to the play. And knowing she had that restraining order on the school, she still went to the school. And so now this is where they at. So she's irate about this whole thing. But my my point is that if you never tried to meddle in that school's business and only simply been a parent, join the PTA. If you want, if you want to yeah. meddle the business of the school, if you join the PTA, that's the proper way to do it. But don't take it upon yourself to try to resolve the issues of the school or roam through the school or whatever, whatever it may be. Just follow the rules. Yeah, that's nice, Mask. Uh, yep. Yeah, yeah, that's great. Great stuff, man. Great, great stuff. So petty, bro. Who, who is that, Dr. Mask? You're so petty, bro. Who, who I can't, that, I can't, I can't, I can't stand back and watch this. Mm. This Rick, the Rick Down Mechanics. We gonna get this done right now. Can we? Can we? Can Rhett, we? Rhett, oh, Rhett, 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 Rhett. Dr. Mass, I apologize for what he's doing. 
No, I don't, he's he's here. I don't know if he took a vaccine already because he is already out of line. Sir, right. you, I, I apologize on I, behalf of Max. Let me know. He, 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 me he, know. You don't deserve this, bro. Who could that man? Man? Because that man showed up in your time slot last week. My Jake, time? you see this? You don't know, act like we didn't talk last week, Dr. Bass. We had a one on one. Dan, please. I, I know you're upset, sir, but I'm working on a new form of NYB if you need to kind of take some. I don't want to take your NYB. Huh? I don't know. What, what's the, uh, <laughs> whatever, man. Jake, Y'all, we got to ban him. Let, let's ban. No, let's no, let's no, vote no, right no. now. Let's you ban Dr. Master mask from mask on. We need to vote you. You know, we really do. Because you are completely out of line when it comes I'm, I'm not. to Dr. Mask. You're completely out of line. The man sold an advertisement lot last week. And we're not going to confront him about it. You're horrible, bro. You're horrible. 